It's by head coach Doc Rivers, Avery Bradley, the vet, CJ Gilgis Alexander, and he's in place of the coaching staff. Something can go eight, nine, even ten deep. It's Gortat and Steven Adams. As Avery Bradley is getting beat up by Terrence Ferguson. And Gallinari. A team that wanted to be defensive oriented, but it's a team. Speaking of defense right there, how about Jeremy Grant coming over in the help with the rejection? Westbrook inside. Adams able to muscle his way. Tough off balance shot there for Gallinari. And the lob, and Adams able to get behind the defense on another perfect kick. As Westbrook just kind of sags off of him. Second chance opportunity. Harris open in the corner. Fires up the three. That one drops in. Was the Western Conference Player of the Month in October, November. Now George finds Adams. Adams been living on that shot over the last. Avery Bradley with a greenness on him. Let him go one on one and convert him to, to stay up beat. George on the hip of Harris doesn't matter. Ball. It's Grant in the corner. Got the height advantage on Bradley. Lowers the shoulder, creates some space. Has the easy move. More difficult it is for him to guard him. Just good recognition on the matchup. Having a much smaller guard trying to defend him, even though Avery Bradley's a good defender. Strong, and the tap was just a little bit short. Bradley steps into the three. Make it back-to-back -back for the quick shooting. One note for his defense. Only after about six points a game. How about it? Green is going right at Grant, trying to maneuver, the contact, and it falls in, and the quick rookie. Lucas Alexander over to the corner, there's Gallinari, he's good from three, need to come to the Thunder. And also the Thunder do a great job of developing their young talent. Gallinari lines up another three ball. Now let me ask you that question, is that sustainable? Well, it wasn't last night. I mean, the Clippers continue to rely on that three ball. Paul George answers Travis to this valuable shot, the three ball. But you're right, there has to be some kind of balance to it. Paul George lines up with the three ball. And Stand the shot, another got inbound pass away. Thanks again, a shooter. Noel is in, and how about the Donados here? It's the defensive player. This time, he gives it up. Already, we talked about the paint for the Thunder. Adosic over the corner, another three for the clip. Schroeder directing traffic, had the advantage, got to the rim, and another finish that time with the left. <laughs> I hope you got a lot of clothes. You have barely enough time to get your laundry done. A lot of dress shirts, no time to get to the dry cleaners, and there's Matres Westbrook turnover. There's a transition, Teodosic three. And Michael, you think that the three-point shooting is Diallo in transition? Trying to reach around, break the poke. Ball movement, sets up Beverly's three. That is good, and you know that the Clippers... Thunder. You're going to need all, every guy as much of the depth as possible. Harris lines up another three ball. Contact, no call. There's Paul George, stampedes ahead, wants the three, got the three. Ferguson and his couple fouls are back in. Thunder stays down defensively. George gets behind the pack. And soars for the... Slip pass into Adams. Got the sidestep. Gallinari, he does. Good matchup here between George and Harris. Adams trying to hedge out. And stay down is Harris. Sorry, I'm sorry. I, I needed to make a last minute move. Absolutely, that's how you do that. You're, you're, you're a good man, Charlie Brown. Well, defensively, not only did he keep it from going to Gallinari, but he got it to George. Westbrook, wide open three, that is good! In dribbles for the three. In transition, Jeremy Grant keeps it going for the Thunder. Pushing the... Selves. Will the Clippers be one of those teams? Doc Rivers in his sixth year with L.A. Paul George, catch fire three, he stays. George getting pressured in the backcourt by Bradley. Dips it down to Grant, Grant to the rim, stays in the air long enough and... This time it's Jeremy Grant, matched up on Gallinari. Gallinari with a little jab step, creates some space, that's exact. Now Grant's gonna post up Bradley. A couple of physical players. Steps through the double team. Ferguson, the mid-range jumper, that's a... You gotta pick your poison to give up something on that play.
How did Terrence Ferguson know to step out like that? Is that the play or is that just a feel for the game? Speaking of feel for the basketball, another block and Adams in transition. Which is bent from behind the three-point line. Gallinari, ball fake, the hop, the three. That is good. Westbrook slips it to Adams. Adams in and out, no good. Ball springs free. Jeremy Grant thrusts it. Four minutes into this third quarter. George goes at a couple of defense players who are walled up. Continue to attack it. Flippers have not been able to stop the bleeding for the Thunder scoring in that painted area. And another contested takes that historical run. George dances. Paul Jones. Ball handling and footwork. Now Gallinari, another tough step back. Bounces out. This Thunder had a couple of those in recent games. Paul George maybe rubbing off. Definitely wanted that one. Gilgis Alexander bumped off of Grant. Grant was still able to recover to Fenbrook. Tried his patent drive to the rim. With a left hand scoop shot, left it short. Bradley lobs it up. Montrez Harrell. Someone's going to come out of here with three consecutive losses. Thunder certainly don't want it to be them. As Bradley on the baseline, he knocks down that mid. Doing his work on the offensive glass. Another opportunity. Westbrook fires it right back to him. The turnaround. Drops it. Attack. That painted area. Gallinari just throws it to an empty spot in the corner where Bradley pretty good game. Now Adams wants to go to work on Harrell. Westbrook trying to answer the three. He's down. This Thunder defense in a couple of games. Oh, absolutely. we got to keep this up. George! Executive shots. The last three and a half minutes, and that stops with Harold's runner through the... Well, Michael, you brought up a point that you thought that the Clippers should bring in Boban Marjanovic, who's one of the few guys as a Brinus. Gallo three for four from the floor. Now takes a bump from Gallinari. And Gallinari, you don't want him heating up here. He's got five in a row for the Clippers, now with 23 in the game. Schroeder stays in the air that time. Schroeder again this time. Gallinari got stripped on the way up. Here comes Diallo, three on one for the Thunder. Diallo to the rim and the finish. See that shot to win for Vinny Schroeder. Still trying to find his rhythm a little bit as Teodosic is able to get to the rim. Went for the layup and had it knocked away. And Diallo kept playing. And save the ball. Nice pass. Finds the streak eater. It'll be a tough move if he wants to go up against Steven Adams. And I think he knew that he didn't want to go and try to. Still a 12 point game. Harris able to get that left handed run. Avery Bradley shifts him down. Corner three on the way. That is good for Patrick Beck. This was a 16 point Thunder lead just a couple of minutes ago. As Westbrook got some space and knocks it down. A turnover. What do you want to see here from this Thunder offense to try to close this game out? Well, anytime you give the ball to see Michael on the offensive end to try to close this one out. Well, oh, I like the ball movement. You just got to keep moving it like that. That's just great ball movement. And look what it leads to. Tonight, because those are the things that are making life difficult on the Clippers. Boy, another three. He's a guy. <laughs> Westbrook. Little up and under, which is too strong, but Adams with the... And Harris, who's been corralled so far tonight. With that particular play, that we're going into this fourth quarter and late in this ball game is into Paul George. Immediately double team the Clippers, though, foul. Trying to get a five-second call. Finally slipped it to Jeremy Grant, and that is going to do it. He did a great job of just maintaining his cool. And that'll do it. Scott's final shot, ball inbounded, and it's the Thunder outlasting the Clippers to snap what was a two-game losing skid, a brief two-game losing skid. And the Thunder come out with a victory, victory number 18 on the season. I'm surprised they didn't foul. Oh, you can see Doc Rivers is, is, is yelling.